Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel for our very second installment of Breaking Boxes with Mama, with me, Mama Breaks. My whole goal with this is to share my personal boxes with you. I want to share what I'm ripping and why I'm ripping it. And this particular set right here that we're going to rip today is 2023 Marvel Upper Deck Platinum Cards. And I'm so excited because I feel like it looks like a very Topps Chrome-ish Marvel. It's a new Chromium set that they have and it's kind of reminds me a little bit of star wars galaxy chrome because it focuses a lot on the art and the artists particularly in this set i'm going to show you some different insert sets that there are in there and i'm super excited to share this with all of you i figured i could break a few of them for my community on fanatics live on friday nights we like to do star wars and we like to get into to non-sports stuff there overall too i need to open at least a box for myself here before we start i need to make sure i get a feel for it and i and i know what i'm talking about before we start ripping so that's a, another really fun thing about being a breaker this is field research friends field research i'm gonna go and just take it off the top on the left hand side here my husband's gonna be very jealous that i'm ripping one of these without him and look at this box already the scarlet witch here all new original art base set and parallels there's some really great artists on this list already that i've seen i kind of looked them up on instagram a little bit before this right now so i'm so excited without further ado let's get started i have my sleeves and my top loaders ready here um like I said, it's chrome, so I'm assuming that just like Topps Chrome, these parallels are going to be a little thicker. So I have standard, I do have standard top loaders, but I also made sure to have 60 point top loaders ready in case those parallels are a little thicker here. 14 plus, wow. I wonder why, because of the arts? Probably very comic book art centered. And look at this, these packs. I'm so excited. Doctor Doom art is on the pack here very very cool okay let's see here so some of my chases currently and the ones that i've seen on ebay is the storm art is so beautiful and i haven't seen all of them because i know there's art that are variants too some shorter print stuff and i'm not familiar with all the the numbering of the parallels just yet but i will be after this and i have a green like atomic incoming first and a blue so those are called green crackles at a 99 that are hobby only and the blues are called blue tracks okay i'm extremely excited already and let's get started here M mephisto havoc these are really cool inserts too comic book cover inserts brother voodoo and a blue tracks is electro look at that the quality is so good i can't wait to really feel it right now in a second rogue okay rogue is one of my favorite characters growing up too i really enjoyed the original x-men series i haven't uh watched the new the new series that's been out just yet and that's gonna be a oh gambit right behind rogue that's a good sign give me a gambit here gambit's my husband's favorite character in a kid omega i thought it was gambit for a second with the purple but man that is gorgeous i don't know if you can see the lighting there but man i really love these x force and this is 95 out of 99 kid, kid omega B suffered a stroke, but he was trying to save something. It was a good thing Kid Omega came. Okay, we're going to keep going here. These retail around anywhere from, I feel like, around $200 right now. If the packs look anything like this with two parallels each, I think that's a pretty, pretty great deal. If you ask me, Mary Jane Watson here. Yeah, it's looking like that. Oh, my goodness. We have a green. We have a green, and that's, um, that's not green crackle. That might be a seismic hole. Here we go, Loki. So those are, that's a green and that's a blue. That may be a cosmic and that may be a seismic gold. I'm hoping here. Bullseye is a really great uh, refractor there out of Daredevil. That's fun. And we have a Morbius. Morbius. And that one's not numbered. And a tombstone is a ray wave. Tombstone is a ray wave. At a 7.99, these are called teal waves. 
And these not numbered are yellow rainbows. They are yellow rainbows. Electra, that's super cool art for Electra there. Gamora. Okay, okay, okay. I wonder if they put the they don't put the artist name on this, but you can get autos by the artist on um on their arts that they reprinted on here. So let's get one of those. Oh, we have two different types of golds here. She-Hulk, uh, Malekith, more cover art here. Green Goblin Refractor is pretty awesome. Spider-Girl, I love it. Look at that. That's a really cool Spider-Girl. I want a Scarlet Witch. I kind of want some parallels of that one already. Iron Man, Iron Man, Green Goblin, and a Spider-Woman. Let's go, baby. That's a yellow rainbow. I'll take it. Not numbered, but I'll take it. And that's a Scarlet Witch at a $3.99 yellow spotlight. I wish that was lower numbered. I'm assuming that's one of the best hits out of the set. It is the cover art that's on the cover of the box. I love it. Definitely excited about this hit right here. And Spider-Man yellow, uh, spider Woman Yellow Rainbow is pretty awesome. Two. So far, so good. It's going to be really hard not ripping this entire case. I'm telling you that right now. We have another teal. Oh, and we buy, we got a red, baby. I think I was looking at these. They're still kind of higher number two. They're not as low, but they're at a 199, but could still pretty be pretty good if we get a Spider-Man as a color match. Invisible Woman here. Gwen Stacy. That's such a great cover art card there norman osborne and a null refractor okay we have a teal oh let me grab this carnage my my son's really gonna love that one i have to sleeve and top load that one for him a null the gwen stacy my son likes as well no and a red is a bishop i love it bishop is my uh, german shepherd's name and Mole Man is our teal wave. Our teal wave. Very cool stuff. That's definitely a card that the kids are adding to the PC right there. And it's not numbered. Hold up. Hold up. It's not numbered. It's actually a red rainbow. And I'm just now realizing that the name of the refractor is on the bottom of the card. Well, look at me. I am such a noob when it comes to opening up or deck product. You're all seeing it firsthand. And judge me if you must. But I'm enjoying my box and just deciding to share it with you, okay? This is the first one here. Oh, we got a purple. Purple pixels are out of 35, baby. Let's do this. Nick Fury. That's some beautiful art for Nick Fury there. On a refractor, I really love it. I'm still even top load that one. That's definitely a keeper. Daredevil art. And I have something out of 35 coming after this. Magic's pretty sick. Make sure, I hope that one's numbered and not just another red rainbow. And our pixel. Oh, that, friends, is a color match. And that is out of 35 super scroll. I like it a lot. Cover variant purple pixel. So that's also a short print because it's one of the cover variants. I like it. Upper deck makes it super easy to know what you're hitting here. Okay. No guessing. You know it's short print. You know it's out of 35. You know it's a cover variant. I like it. Pretty cool red rainbow. My husband's definitely going to want to rip some of this with us as well. And let's keep going here. Winter Soldier. Groot, Electra, Hulk, our refractors, or Charles Xavier. Okay. Not familiar with that art too much. Nice, nice, nice. Ghost Spider is a yellow rainbow, not numbered, but my son, my youngest son, loves Ghost Spider. So he's really going to enjoy that one. Let's see here. This is two months until it's coming. More cover art, cover variant rainbow. There is really cool. I used to play contest, Marvel Contest of Champions quite a bit. So I know who Agent Venom is. I used him quite a bit too. <laughs> if anybody uh, plays that, shout out to Contest of Champions. Took up um, probably a year of my life. Too much, too much. 
too much time of my life there playing that game, but it was really fun. And if you love uh, Marvel, you definitely love it too. I'm hoping that's a red out of 199. Mystique, that art on Mystique is pretty cool. I wish I knew the artist on here. I think I can guess who it was by the artist that was researching off the list. I'm really hoping I get an auto here too. Sandman on the cover art is really cool. Mysterio, Mysterio. And uh, yeah, no, this is kind of like I said, I'm really just enjoying it with you for the first time. I haven't done too much research on it. I just saw a bunch of it on eBay and I've heard people talk about it and I think it's really fun. So that's why I wanted to share that with you. And we have here Magneto. Magneto Super Statistics is also another really cool insert out of this that I like that I was reading about. Super Statistics gives them like um, he has Omega Level 6, Mastermind 5. I love it. I love it. I love it. Magneto is a great character. And our red is a Havoc. Let's go. <laughs> also a red rainbow. Not getting my out of 199 that I keep... Uh, looking for but still kind of fun to see what uh what you can get out of a single box i feel it's a lot of color it's a lot of cool inserts so far i only have two packs three packs left here i'm in love with my ghost with my uh scarlet witch so far and i have a black card incoming black rainbows are one and every 10 hobby packs so that's probably what we're gonna hit here right now Iron Man is a really great art image there. I like that one a lot. A Jackal, a Legion, a Firestar, and an Emma Frost. Emma Frost is cool too. This one is um, Super Statistics Black Cat. And a Black Odin. Odin Thor's daddy. Odin. Black Rainbow, not numbered. Okay, Odin. Okay, Odin. Yeah, uh, as far as like m favorite Marvel movies go, I definitely feel like Civil War is one of my re most recent favorites. Uh, my favorite shows are the original X-Men shows. And even the, the ones where they were teenagers, I can't remember off the top of my head right now. But I've watched every single one of those. My favorite characters are Storm and Rogue. And my whole, my husband is really Marvel obsessed. He actually recently got into cards this past year and has a ton of them. And the kids love Spider-Man. So we're definitely a Marvel family. Look at this Spider-Man Venom art. It's pretty awesome too. There's definitely a lot of cards that I'm seeing in here that I would love to chase. Leader, the amazing Spider-Man Medusa. And the Chrome, I was hoping it would be a little shinier. But honestly, it's really good. It's really good. Can you imagine something like a white border instead of the chrome? Like this. Spider Woman. Secret Wars. Let's see. Super Scroll. And a Sabertooth. Sabertooth Purple. Rainbow. The first live action X-Men movie. The Sabertooth came out. I thought that was so awesome. Okay, this is my last pack here. The Thing. Oh, please tell me that's a cosmic. Please tell me that's a cosmic out of 25. I saw Miles Morales on eBay and I thought it was one of the coolest, coolest parallels ever. I'm excited. Let's do this. If it's not a cosmic, maybe I'll open another box. We'll see. Oh, Typhoid Mary. What's this? That's also a rainbow, but it looks a little different. Red Skull with the Captain America disguise is a blue. Is a blue tracks out of four ninety nine maybe? And I have oh, it's another teal wave. War machine, not bad, not bad. That's actually a blue rainbow. It's not a blue tracks. The blue tracks are numbered. And uh platinum duels. Okay, well that was in two. Too out of the ordinary or exciting here at a seven ninety nine. Okay, everyone. So this is one box out of an inner case. You saw there was two, four, six, eight in an inner, sixteen boxes in a full case. You get a lot of color, so I think it's really fun. The idea of joining character breaks in this. I'm gonna definitely have some personals or maybe some serial breaks that we can do on our Fanatics live stream on Friday on Star Wars Friday. But this is essentially my recap here, everyone. Red Skull, Blue Rainbow. War Machine, Teal Wave at a seven ninety nine, Sabretooth, uh, Purple Rainbow, Odin, Black Rainbow, Havoc, 
Red Rainbow. Oh, Secret Avengers Agent Venom. This is a cover variant rainbow. Very sick there. Ghost Spider Yellow Rainbow. Magic Red Rainbow. Bishop Red Rainbow. Mole Man. Teal Wave at a $7.99. Spider Woman. Yellow. Moribus Yellow. Tombstone at a $7.99. Electro Blue. And a Kid Omega. It's pretty, pretty beautiful. My lowest numbered was this one right here. And this is called a Purple Pixel. These are Hobby and E-Pack only. And that is a Super Scroll cover variant Purple Pixel. And my favorite card. It's a little off-centered, you know? A little 80-20, maybe more there. But out of three ninety nine, Scarlet Witch, Scarlet Witch with the cover arts. Yellow Spotlight's pretty awesome. If you ask me, I love that they have her power grid there too. Miss Wanda Maximoff. And thank you so much for joining us for another box break here. I hope you enjoyed it. Please like and subscribe and please give us feedback on how we can make these better for you. Stepping out, signing out. I'll see you soon.